The idiots have been in charge way too long. And that's why you're here. For the podcast you need. All for liberty all the time. Welcome to Liberty Bites Back. With your host, Brandon Immel. And then our other story is about iHeartMedia, which now is iHeart Epstein Island goers, as Bill Clinton is going to be hosting a podcast with them. Now, who wants to listen to Bill Clinton on a podcast? Well, anyone who hates this podcast, I recommend his. Go ahead, listen to The Creep instead, if you hate how I expose the mainstream darlings and such. But, in 2021, Bill Clinton will be launching the Idiotic pod Podcast. Craig Menison, the Chief Communications and Marketing Officer for the Clinton Foundation, confirmed the deal to Deadline, which first reported the agreement. The show will be built on his gift for storytelling. Oh yeah, I'm sure he lies out his butt. <laughs> His ability to explain complex issues in a relatable way and showcase his wide range of interests. Yeah, which interests are you going to be talking about, Bill Clinton? And the well-known intellectual curiosity through conversations. Is that why you're on the island? For conversations? It's not what the witness says. It says you were with a young girl. About two of them, to be exact. And about the ideas and events that continue to shape his world. I mean, his work in our world. I don't know. What ideas and events I want to be. I want of his of shape of my world, but. If you're into that, I guess you can. Check his podcast out. Now, the Clinton Foundation's previous podcast, which was Why Am I Telling You This? Which launched last year featuring Chelsea Clinton as a co-host and several high-profile guests. Well, while he's launching his podcast, America's Witch, Hillary Clinton, is planning to launch hers this year as well. I hope she goes over how the chicken in the backyard is setting up, is set up for mold luck and such, just like her weird revealing emails indicated. And I would never understand how any organization thinks that this is a good idea to place Bill Clinton with his Epstein past onto their network, nor Hillary on their airlines and think anything good will happen from it. Hmm. It's lunacy at its best, folks.